Hello viewers and welcome to today's quest. We have the Witch's Potion. I can start this quest by speaking to Hetty in her house in Remington, west of Port Sarim. You can buy half of the things and all you'll need is 4 GP for that. Warning that this does give magic experience in case you're not after that. What you're going to want to bring with you is either meat or burnt meat. On your way here, stop in at the magic shop and buy Eye of Newt for 3 GP. Go south to Weissen's food shop, buy a piece of raw beef for 1 GP, or alternatively, if if there is none in stock for some reason. You can go just to this little graveyard area here by the church and you can off the rats there. And then you want to pick up one of the meat. And then you can get the onion from this patch right here. The rat tail that you need for this can only be gotten after you've started the quest. Fastest way to get here is just from Falador or Draenor, just come just down this way. It's just to the west of Port Sarim. So when you're here and you speak to Hetty, choose chat options one and one. I am in search of a quest. Yes, help me become one with my darker side. So there's a couple of rats over here in this house just to the west of her. Just got to kill one with my awesome combat stats. That will knit you the rat tail. Now I did not burn my beef yet. So what I'm going to do is just north of Hetty. There is a range. Uh oh, I cooked it. So if you cooked it, use it again and you'll burn it. And then there you go. Talk to Hetty and quest complete. Just that easy. Okay, drink up. Congratulations, you've completed the Witch's Potion quest. You're awarded one quest point and 325 magic XP. And that's pretty much will it for this. Yay! So, thanks for watching. I hope this helped. If you'd like to show your support, feel free to give it a thumbs up or down below. And if you'd like to leave some feedback or just to say hi, feel free to drop a comment in the section below as well. You can follow the links in my description below to my Patreon, Twitter, Facebook, Streamlabs, and the very rare time that I actually stream on Twitch. And until the next guide, ciao!